Peace everybody, back with another video. This is a breaking news. This is five dead dozens hospitalized in Pennsylvania turned by crash. And as you can see here in the screenshot is um, the FedEx truck and, uh, and other trucks. And of course the accident happened here at the turnpike. At least five people were killed and dozens were injured in a crash early Sunday involving multiple vehicles on the Pennsylvania Turnpike, a transportation official says. So yeah, five people were killed, um, dozens were injured, and of course they're at the hospital. And this happened early Sunday involving multiple vehicles on the Pennsylvania Turnpike, a transportation official has said. The fatal crash involving a tour bus, two tractor trailers, and passenger vehicles also injured at least 60 people according to pennsylvania turnpike spokesman carl de febo he said in a tweet the tour bus flipped on its side so yeah so the tour bus had um flipped on its side and of course this fatal crash involving two tour bus two tractor trailers and a passenger vehicle so of course there was injured at least 60 people according to pennsylvania turnpike spokesman um he said in a tweet the tour bus flipped on its side defibio said a coroner confirmed five fatalities at the scene which happened in westmoreland county around 30 miles east of Pittsburgh. Yeah, so the coroner has confirmed has confirmed five fatalities, so that means five people are dead um at the scene. And this happened over at Westmoreland County, about thirty miles east of Pittsburgh. So if you're around that area, please avoid that area immediately because the police are trying to clean up the mess right now. So um if and if they're still investigating, please do not go around that area. There were 25 victims ranging in age from 7 to 52 years old, transported to Axilla Frick Hospital in Mount Pleasant. Axilla Health spokeswoman Robin Jennings said, Nine of those patients are under the age of 18. So nine are under the age of 18. So that means they're like teenagers, young little ones, um, and of course the adults. Um, so, so 50, and they are from ranging from the age of 7 to 52 years old. Um, they were, um, and this is what Robin Jennings said. Nine of those patients are under the age of 18. At least one of the 25 victims initially sent to Axilla was transported to a nearby trauma center and the rest of the patient's conditions were not known, Jennings said. Yes, yeah, so it was 25 um, victims initially sent to Axilla was transported to nearby trauma center. Um, and of course, the conditions were not known, Jennings said, for the other one, or for these um, people that were at the hospital. Details of what caused the accident were not immediately available, and the National Transportation Safety Board investigators were called to the scene. The National Weather Service forecast for Westmoreland County early Sunday Listened, listed light unknown precipitation and an air temperature just below freezing. DeFevio said it was premature to say if weather was a factor in the crash. Yeah, so you never, so they still determined if the um, weather was the factor in the crash. And of course, you know, um, the weather usually does have something to do with it but not all the time um the national weather service forecast call for westmoreland county said early listed light unknown precipitation um details of what caused the accidents were not immediately available of course and so they're still 
determining if the weather was a factor in the crash. It is likely that at least a portion of the turnpike will be closed for the rest of the day, DeFibio said. Yes, yeah, so the, the part of the um, turnpike will be closed for the rest of the day. So if you just happen to be around that area, please avoid that area until something can be worked out or until the investigation is done because this is very serious with the crime or i should say the um accident scene and five people have been confirmed deceased so please avoid that area if you're around that area leave your comments below i am out